What's up? This is Jared. And this is Duddy. We are the Dirty Heads, and this, this is, is our hip, hip clip. clip. Motherfuckers right here People call us dirtbags And you know that we just don't care We wanted to be that band That you'd listen to And get a certain vibe And it'd be a, you know, a good time You come to our shows To have a good time I'm gonna come to their the Dirty Head show tonight To get wasted with my friends To hook up with some girls You know we want to pervade, well, like, that's our vibe that we want to give out. So if you got good people around you and you got good friends and stuff, it's still not that hard to write songs about, you know, having fun. We definitely get, like, a, I think, a more laid-back vibe from living on the beach, but also it's just from the people you hang out with. And, you know, if you got other respectful, happy people hanging around with you your whole life, that's how you're going to be. And we've been pretty lucky that we travel with good friends and, it's been pretty easy. Um, the South was really rough. Yeah. We uh, we didn't have a lot of fans in the South. Some funny <laughs> stuff happened. Some some characters we got to meet uh, out at the shows. We walked into a breakfast place one day just to get breakfast, and we didn't know. And it was like on literally record, and just every old big dude in a cowboy hat was just like what are these long-haired hippies doing in my fucking <laughs> breakfast place right now and we were like ooh you know these guys got tattoos and long hair we got like just the worst surface and nobody wanted us there so we just ate and got the fuck out well it's the dirty heads man he's straight from the pacific i don't really like him any kind of dipshits this one's a drunk and while the other gets lifted this one's a punk you don't believe me just listen i don't know new york i'm just stoked to be in new york so yeah. tonight we'll see how it goes but uh, I'm having a fucking blast. It's cold, I'm not used to the cold. I honestly hate the cold, but just to be over here, it's pretty fucking awesome, it's rad. I'm having a good time. We're looking forward to some pizza too. That's where we're going right after this. <laughs> Yeah, we uh, cut a hole in the roof and we all just jumped off, broke our asses. I painted half the boat with my friend Cameron uh, that does a lot of artwork for other bands, um, Cam Rackman. And uh, we just kind of sat around in the studio and we're like, this would be funny if we had this boat in the desert and then we had to get it out. No, and then we talked to the director and uh, it, we, we ended up doing it in the garage, trying to take it back. So it was pretty much all of our, you know, it was our brainstorming. Our management constantly kept trying to hide beer from us because they didn't want us to look all haggard on the screen. They're like, you guys can't get drunk while you're doing this video, but we found it. We did that shit. You know what? Shitty was holding that boat all day for two days. It's fucking heavy. Our drummer and our percussion player both had explosive diarrhea at the exact same time on their close-ups. So, yeah. That was very unexpected. <laughs> it definitely was a lot of fun. I mean, we got to go in a broken down old canoe out into the ocean and paddle around. That was that was great. The, the whole idea of the video was our idea. We came up with the concept. It wasn't like, here, we want to put you in this boat and do this, you know. It was our idea. And if so, if it's a stupid idea, it's, it's our fault. <laughs>